All right guys, so this is how to apply lashes with no wing liner 101. You are here because you are interested in finding out how to seamlessly apply false lashes when you are not wearing liner because we all know the struggle of doing that. So you can totally see the freaking lash band and it is not cute. So here are the things you will need. An eyelash curler, some mascara, Definitely some little falsies, lash glue, and some tweezers. So the first thing I'm going to do is curl my lashes. I like to start at the very tip, and I curl them for about five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. I go in the middle. One, two, three, four, five. And then I go at the very root. Make sure not to pinch yourself. One, two, three, four, five. And I just kind of like jiggle it. And I'm going to do the same thing to this eye. Now I'm going to apply some mascara. Whatever you use is fine. You really don't have to use any fancy mascara because we're going to hide our lashes with the fake ones. So I'm just going to apply a very thin coat of this. Now for lashes, you want to make sure that you get something that has a thinner band because if you use something that has a thick band, you're definitely going to see it. It's going to be a little bit more no noticeable. So the ones I'm, I'm going to be using today are these and these are the Vegas name shining star lashes so when they are brand new sometimes it's hard to mold them to your eye what i like to do is i like to take them like this and i just kind of twist it like i just go back and forth like this and you kind of break the band a little bit not break like where you can't use it but you just kind of mold it and it'll fit a little bit better because sometimes they're so thick that you just can't wear them. So after you've chosen your eyelashes, you want to make sure that they fit your eye because sometimes they're too long. I have really freaking big old ojos, so sometimes they fit perfectly. But what you want to do is you want to make sure first which one goes on the right and which one goes on the left. Believe it or not, it makes a difference. So. For example, these, I've already cut them because I don't have any new lashes to open. Now, when you are measuring them, just take them out of the box and kind of measure them to your eye. And whatever you see of excess, just go ahead and cut it off. You want to make sure that you cut from here, like from this end, and not the inner corners of where the, or the lashes go. Because here, they flare out. They go from small and then they flare out to big. So if you chop them from the front, they're just going to look weird. So make sure you cut them from the end. Now, we're going to apply the glue. This is the Ardell Lash Grip, Lash Grip, at, what? Eyelash Adhesive Glue. This is the one that I've been using. It works okay, I actually like the one from the brand Kiss, it's like a $2 lash glue, and this works okay. Um, I definitely think that there's better glues out there, like the House of Lashes. I've heard that one's really good. I still haven't tried it, but I like to squeeze mine out a little bit out of the tube. Okay, that was a lot, but I usually squeeze a little bit. And then I'll just apply a thin, thin layer. Make sure you're not applying a friggin' big old glob because then it takes forever to dry. Personally, I like to apply my glue one lash at a time. So I'm just going to apply. So as you can see, that's how much glue I put on mine. Hopefully you can see that. Now we're just gonna let that dry for about 10, 15 seconds. So I'm going to take my lash and I'm going to start I like to start at the inner corner some people like to start in the center but I'm just going to start on the inner corner and you want to make sure that you apply it as close as close as possible to the lash line now once the lash is actually on what I like to do is I like to pinch the fake lashes and my lashes together so I'll just go around and I'll pinch them together that way they just stick and they're one instead of having you know your lashes and then the actual lashes okay. 
I like to go back with my mascara and I will apply just a little bit more. So now I'm just going to apply my other eyelash. Now keep in mind that the thinner the band, again, the more natural your lashes are going to look. So now I'm just quickly going to apply some mascara to my bottom lashes. So that is it guys. Super easy. I really hope you guys learned something new and I hope I helped you because you've been get, I've been getting tons of questions on how to apply lashes without any eyeliner. So I mean it's not it's not going to look it's not going to look 100% natural and again keep in mind the thinner the band the more natural it is actually going to look so if you want to try like the Ardell Wispies those have a super thin line or um, band so it's going to look very very natural these are a little bit on the thicker side either way I hope you guys enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up if you did and that is everything thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to subscribe if you haven't and to follow me on all my social media links I will have all the names down below but they're all at OMG Lashes I love you guys and I'll see you soon. Bye!